monsters. Seven little monsters. Thank you, Bill and Belinka. Ah, a fine flower planting day it is. Why are my ducals being inside on such a beautiful day? Outside, everyone. All righty, yes, Mama. Yes, Mama. Yes, Mother. Okay, Mommy. Yes, Mama. <laughs> Mom's right. It is a beautiful day. We should do something really fun. Like what? I don't know. What do you want to do? I don't know. What do you want to do? I don't know. What do you want to do? Why don't we? Yes. yes. Ooh, I forgot what I was going to say. I know. Mm. Why don't we put up a tent mm. and camp out in the mm. backyard? Nah. I have an idea. Mm. Heidi ho, lovers of the open range and all things outdoorsy. Ranger 3 here. I say, what are you doing out here in this vast wilderness all by yourselves? This isn't the wilderness. It's just our backyard. <laughs> a backyard, perhaps, but it's still filled with wild creatures. Why, there's a Lumbricus terrestris right at your feet. What? Lumbricus terrestris. That's Latin for common earthworm. Cool. Wow. And there, behind you, is the passer domesticus. <laughs> the house sparrow. Are there any other wild animals in our backyard? <laughs> you bet there are. Would you like to learn all about them while spending a night out here under the stars in our very own tent? Fine, cat out! Yeah, I want to camp out too. Me too. But when I suggested it, you... You don't have to join us if you don't want to, one. But I wanted to camp out before. Let's get cracking. There's lots to do. What should we do first? Pack some clothes. I think we should pack some clothes. <laughs> Marvelous idea, Seven. Let's go. Ugh. When preparing for a campout, one must first consider the weather. You mean weather to wear diamonds or piles? That seems like a lot of clothes for one night. I'm going to need the big suitcase, too. Will you get it for me? Sure, Six. Huh? <gasps> it's too high. I'll give you a boost. I could fly up and get it. Wait. I have a better idea. You're not really going to climb that, are you, Four? Of course not. Seven's going to. I am. Very brave of you to volunteer, Seven. Oh, dear. Mom, you said if someone's doing something that's dangerous, we should always tell you, right? That's right. Well, someone's doing something dangerous. Oh, my. It looks a little wobbly. Don't worry. I've prepared a cushy safety net in case you should fall. Aha! Babushkas! Huh? Now is the time to not be taking one step more. Hi, Mom. I was just trying to get the big suitcase down for six. If help you are needing to get something from a high shelf, always must you be asking me. Yes, yes Mama. Mom. I, I told him not to do it, Mom. Really? <laughs> Shaming on you for not coming to me. Only one did that, and for that she is thanks deserving. And Six, you are not the big suitcase needing. You take only a few things on the camping out. Yes, Mother. <laughs> thanks a lot, One. Thanks for ruining my camp out. Now I'll have nothing to wear. <laughs> but I... Heidi ho we've no time to waste. We must continue preparing for our wilderness adventure. We should probably pack some snacks. To the kitchen! We'll be needing some snacks. Good idea, Three. Yummy! Since
since we'll have dinner before going out, all we'll need to pack is a bedtime snack. What should we bring? Yummy bubblegum! Chopped chicken salad. Oysters! I vote for pickle and peanut butter ice cream sundaes. How are we going to decide what to pack if everyone wants something different? Let's just take everything in the fridge. Yeah, great idea. But Mom always says we should have just one treat before bedtime or we'll get tummy aches. Aw, oh, come on. Mom would want us to starve, would she? No, but... Come on, Five. Give me a hand. <coughs> five. <coughs> Sorry. Mom! Yes, One? Four's packing up the whole fridge to take on our camp out. That is not a good idea. Uh, Four. What do you want, One? I've got to finish this before Mom finds out. What are you doing, Four Chick? That's a very good impression of... Mom! I was just... You were just all the food to the fridge returning, yes? Yes, that's exactly what I was doing. <laughs> Quickly, Five. The only snack food you are needing is healthy-making dried fruit leather. Nice going, one. You've ruined everything. Now all we have to eat is fruit leather. Well, if you'd all listen to me the first time when I said... What's that sound? It's the call of the wild. Let's go! <laughs> Goodbye, madam. We're off to commune with Mother Nature. Have you any final words for your brave children? Taking your toothbrushes, are you? Okie dokie, Mommy. Now watch and learn as I determine the approaching weather. Unless I'm mistaken, I know what this means. You have dirty hair? No, it means we'll be getting an avalanche of snow! In July. And that means we must move fast. Two and seven, you set up the tent. Four and five, prepare the snacks. Six and I will look out for wild animals. What can I do? Whatever you like. Okay, seven. <laughs> what I said? Oh, no. Do it ourselves. You don't have to yell. Ugh. I'm telling Mom. Mom, Seven yelled at me. Oh, thank you for telling me, one. I've divided our snack food into seven equal piles. Not equal. You're right. They're not equal. Uh, um. oh. There. Now they're equal. I saw that, and I'm telling! Mom! Four isn't sharing the snacks! Thank you for telling me, One. What are we looking for, Ranger Three? We're looking for anything that might endanger our safety. Or keep us from having a good time. Then I think I see something. What is it? Where? My sister. <laughs> Mom! What is it, One? Six stuck her tongue out at me! <sighs> One, maybe these things aren't all that serious, being. But didn't you tell us that making faces at someone isn't nice? Yes, One. It is not nice, but... What's up with One? She's always telling on us. She's sticking her nose in everyone's business. Camping isn't gonna be any fun with her around. I don't think I want to camp out tonight. Hey, the tent's up. It looks great. Well, you can sleep in it. I'm going inside. Yeah, me too. Ah! Why is everyone going in? They've just witnessed the most troublesome creature of all, the wild tattletale. Well, I'm still camping out, and I can have a good time all by myself. <sighs> How is going the camp out? Where are the others being? They went inside. Why? I guess they were mad about me telling on them. But I was only trying to help. Really? When you come telling me that Six was faces making, 
Was that for the helping? Well, no, I guess I wasn't really trying to help. You have to be knowing when to tell and when not to tell. I guess it's okay to tell on someone if you're helping them out of trouble, but not if you're just doing it to get them into trouble. Exactly, my clever one, Ling. Huh. I guess I'd better go and apologize. <laughs> Four shouldn't be wearing underwear on his head. Mom! What is it, my one Ling? Uh, nothing. So I said, I am sitting down. <laughs> <laughs> huh? Listen, it's the tap of the yellow bellied zap sucker. Yellow bellied sister is more like it. She's probably going to tell on us for having fun. Quick, take these. Oh, oh no. <laughs> <laughs> we thought you were coming to tell on us again. I can't believe it. I can't believe she stole my best joke. <laughs> I have something important to say. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry for being such a tattletale. I just did it because no one was listening to me. What did she say? Four? <laughs> just kidding. We should have paid attention to you, one. Sorry. 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 I'm sorry, one. Now, who wants to go camping? Ah, <sighs> finally. Some peace and quiet happened. Yes!